today for this video we're going to write the equation of a circle in standard form and then after we write it we're going to go ahead and graph it. Um, the standard form of a circle is x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared and basically what this is is the distance formula. Um, we're talking about the radius like Basically, if you think about what a circle is, a circle is all points that are equidistant from a single point. Um, so this is just the general form of the distance formula. It's not just two points, but that's really where it's derived from. Um, H and K is always the center. So if you notice, the H is positive, but in the problem, it's X minus H. So you always have to change the sign of whatever you are given. And K is your Y coordinate of your center. And r is simply the radius um, to any point on that circle. So what we're given is we're given that the center is at 0, negative 1. So this would be our h and our k. And then r would be the 3. So what we all you have to do with this when you're writing it in standard form, this is the easy one. All you have to do is just simply plug in h. So I would replace h with 0. I don't technically have to write it, but I'm going to just go ahead and show out all the work so that you see um, where I got everything from. Remember, it's always y minus k, so I really have to do y minus negative 1 equals my radius squared. So now if we just simplify this, we would end up with x squared plus y plus 1 squared equals 9. So if it asks for the standard form of a circle, this would be your answer. As far as graphing it goes, all you have to do to graph um, a circle is you would start with the center. So we would go to 0, negative 1. So that would be right here. This would be our center of our circle. And from our center, we would just use our radius and go out 3 in each direction. So I would go out 3 to the right. I would go up 1, 2, 3, I would go to the left one, two, three, and I would go down one, two, three. Now, if you have a compass, it makes a much better circle. It's very difficult to draw a circle with this, so um, just do the best that you can. Um, circles are hard to draw, so none of your teachers are going to be really critical of your circle. But you could always use a tool like a compass or something to help you get it a little bit more circular. As always, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, please let me know.